Now, Cap KVU First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. We've made it to midweek. Hope you're having a good morning so far. Just a lovely day today with a bit of building clouds as the day goes on. Light rain is expected overnight into tomorrow morning for mostly Yakima and Ellensburg, then spreading out as the evening goes on. We are warming into the weekend. We are free and clear on our radar. Just a beautiful morning. Get ready for ample sunshine in the next hour or so. So for our future cast, as we get into our Wednesday evening, as I said, a little bit of building clouds, and then we'll see those showers start to form Yakima, Ellensburg area, maybe fanning out a little bit for some brief showers for the Mid-Columbia and Pendleton. Then as we move into our afternoon, it kind of solidifies right over into Ellensburg and Yakima, and then it will fan out as we get to the evening hours and into our Friday morning. So more shower activity on the way. These should be pretty darn light, so uh, not too much to be concerned about, but some precipitation is on the way. So just plan ahead with your uh, with whatever you're planning to do tomorrow with a little bit of shower activity. Hot spot right now, 20, uh, 37 for the Tri-Cities, 23 in Yakima, 20 in Ellensburg. So folks, very chilly there. If you're heading out the door anytime soon, please bundle up. We are just below the freezing mark or right at it for most of our cities, except for the Tri-Cities. And again, clear skies, well, that is what happens. As we move along into our weekend, we are going to be just slightly right at or slightly above our average, 67 on your Saturday. But we're now cooling down to just below our average on our Sunday, Easter Sunday. Could even see a little bit of shower activity for your weekend. And as we head into our next work week, we are going to be staying just below our average. So. Cool temperatures are sticking with us. At least we're staying a little closer to average than we have. We have more or less light winds, double digits for the Tri-Cities at 10, but we have pretty much light winds today and tomorrow. Then Friday and Saturday, we'll see between 10 and 20 mile per hour winds. Not as heavy as we saw over the weekend or last weekend, but still some breezy conditions on the way. Then we'll see between 15 and 25 mile per hour winds as we get into our next work week. All right, it's our 2023 countdown. We are one day away from that Tri-Cities Dust Devil home opener tomorrow evening, their season opener as well. Four days away from Easter, that NFL draft is three weeks away from tomorrow, right here on Cap KVU ABC. Mid to lower 50s, or mid, mid 50s for the Yakima Valley, 52 for Ellensburg, so just a touch warmer uh, pretty much across the board. Mid to upper 50s for the Mid-Columbia, then over in the Blue Mountain region, we're right in those mid 50s. And Walla Walla, Pendleton, you were at the upper 40s yesterday. So just uh, warmer conditions pretty much throughout with that sunshine. But as we head into tomorrow and Friday, we do have chances of sporadic showers. Into Friday morning, we should see a bit of clearing as we get to Friday evening. Then maybe little bits of showers as well for your weekend, your Easter weekend, and into our next work week. So it looks like a little bit of rain is with us as we're moving uh, closer to the middle part of April. Overnight lows are remaining above the freezing level for the week ahead. Tri-Cities area a little bit warmer, 64 for Thursday and Friday, 67 on Saturday, but down to 60 on your Easter Sunday with off and on showers uh, expected into our next work week as well. But folks, today, let's not forget, it is going to be a beautiful Wednesday. Light winds, highs mid to upper 50s for most of our areas. Just get ready for morning showers, especially in Yakima and Ellensburg tomorrow morning.